talking. Laura. It's like meant to be politically incorrect, right? Put some broccoli, some oil, and some avocado I made last night. Also eating vanilla cake. Mmm. Um, I really got too much water, but meh. It'll turn out tasty. Just have to wait for the water to evaporate, but other than that, it's looking promising. Hey, so got some leftover makeup from last time, so I just like sprayed it on. Not even eyeliner because it's dark enough, so that was perfect. And it's kind of purpley, and um, I have a sports bra inside because I'm going to the gym right afterwards. But right now I'm just heading to chapter meeting and did laundry today. So these are all clean and nice and clean and awesome. And I'm going to change into actual socks. But these fuzzy socks are the best thing ever. Seriously. And I'm also wearing smoked peach on my lips because my eyes are kind of too strong. And I didn't want to do like another berry lip. So I did a really muted lip. It's actually lighter than my lip color. But it's like really pretty. See? And I scratched myself. Yep. That's what happened. And I also have a ton of concealer under my eyes because it just seemed right because I had eye bags, even though I did get good sleep. But anyways, I'm going to head to chapter and I'll see you in a little bit. Bye. Here's the whole outfit. Got my sunglasses, stuff on my face, and my army jacket. Too lazy to take out my wallet, so my wallet's in my jacket. Uh, shirt, pants, socks that are actually the same color, which is awesome. Um, actually gonna go now. I'm so excited because I got new music on my um, Blackberry, so I have new music to listen to now. Lots of Aunt Sharon, new Bonnie Vera songs I did not put on, and stuff like that. And I really have to go, so bye! Sorry the lighting's kind of bad because it's um, already like 7 o'clock and just had a wonderful dinner with turkey and guacamole and lots and lots of pepper. I don't know if I could live without pepper anymore um, and some apple juice. So remember that thing when I, maybe you don't but possibly you do, when I did the vow that I would only go to one club event or a party or drinking like alcohol related party a week? Turns out. Tomorrow is one of my best friend's birthday, so I have to go. Um, it's just going to be so much fun, Which, but then it means that like the weekend I have to be studying and I, go, I have to stay at home and, you know, do rejuvenating things that are not alcohol related, I guess, but I'm just so excited to go to, um, I think we're going to a bar, um, but it's, uh, it's going to be really fun. I'm going to come home really early because I do have a quiz the next day in the morning which is a dreadful because I haven't studied much yet, but I will be studying today. Um, today's chapter was very hard to go through because one of our sisters passed away this summertime. Um, and it's just, we did a little memorial kind of thing for her and it was just so hard. Um, I didn't know her very well, but I remember like the last time I talked to her we actually had a very pretty long conversation and I that was the last time I saw her and it's it's so strange I feel like life is a series of fragments um, and you remember people from the moments of life and they will stay in your heart forever but it's just I don't know it's very sad and I wish she was still here in this world. Um, it was kind of, um, yeah, it's very sad and very tragic because I didn't know her better and I wish I did. But I'm really glad that I did get to know her a little better before she passed away. Hope you guys had a wonderful weekend, and I'll see you tomorrow.